Good morning from Cubacabana, Bolivia. Um, I just arrived here with a Bolivia Hop. So this morning at 7 a.m. I was picked up and uh, yeah, it was about a four hour bus journey. And first of all, I'm really impressed with uh, Bolivia Hop. Uh, we got these uh, bus passes, as you can see here, which also gives you discounts uh, to restaurants and uh, tours and things like that. We had uh, first one stop and then the second stop we had to get off the bus to um, be transported over the lake um, and also the bus had to go on a, another boat to get over the lake uh, yeah and then we jumped back onto the bus and um, then we had another stop which we was a lookout point over beautiful Kubakabana and then we arrived here and uh, yeah, with all of my luggage, I made my way up this very, very steep hill to La Cupula Hotel. I can tell you that I was very, very out of breath. I haven't been that out of breath in a very, very long time. Uh, it was very tough. Uh, the hotel is absolutely beautiful with an amazing view over uh, the bay um, and a lovely room. Now I'm going to uh, attempt to find some lunch before I'm going to jump on a boat to Isla del Sol. Uh, so yeah, let's head out there. And I have made it to the harbour after a very quick lunch. Um, we're boarding the boat now to Isla del Sol, which is about roughly an hour uh, boat ride away. So yeah, let's head to Isla del Sol. Already packing, come with me. I'm not really asking. We have boarded the boat now and we are heading towards Isla del Sol. Distractions will get away. This is what we waited for. So, we are currently hiking the trail and uh, we have made it up to the highest point. Uh, so, now it's downhill, which is much nicer because uh, it was quite hard for the breath uh, to get up. But, yeah, behind me here, you have Isla de Luna. Uh, the island of the moon uh, yeah and it was said that here the sun was born and there the moon was born so yeah we're going to make our way down to the harbor down there uh, to catch the boat back to Cubacabana but yeah it's a really beautiful hike this and definitely worth coming uh, yeah. take my hand we'll make it somehow we can't miss out So the boat back to Cubacabana leaves in 10 minutes, so I've been trying to uh, speed up uh, on the way down here to make it, but yeah, I can see the harbour now, so I think we'll make it in time. Uh, we stopped off to have a cold drink overlooking the amazing view over Lake Titicaca, so that was really nice. Uh, yeah, so now we are about to board the boat back to Cubacabana. With the lights out, doubt with my own doubt. Be free with me. Be free. Be so I have started to hike towards the first peak, and I've maybe walked 200 meters just up this very steep hill. Um, but yeah, I'm uh, completely out of breath. Uh, yeah, it's very, very tough, but yeah, the peak is up here, there, so yeah, it's quite steep, but I'm taking my time. 
<laughs> but yeah, the view is amazing and uh, also the sun is shining, blue sky, so I'm not complaining. <laughs> distance you can also see the very famous uh, cathedral here in Copacabana and this place is actually a very uh, sacred place and uh, there are lots of uh, religious uh, monuments and um, yeah different things here so that's kind of also what Copacabana is uh, famous for. So the struggle is definitely real I've had to uh, sit down for a while just to catch my breath but yeah this view is so amazing. I've come to see the other side uh, of the bay and it's just uh, breathtakingly beautiful. <laughs> Not looking back, eyes on the freeway, Bonnie and Clyde, a classic cliche. We're on the run, this is what we waited for. Uh, they are very good at making uh, soups here in, in Bolivia so I had a vegetable soup with uh, rice and potatoes which was very filling and nice so yeah and uh, now I'm uh, collecting my bags and I'm going to head down to uh, catch the bus to Puno in Peru so yeah I'll see you next time